moko a malamu et pas une bande de basuli bako ya koza le longo na bis. Good evening to all those I've had the chance to be with us. Nzambe aza malamu. God is good. Nzambe aza bolingo. God is loving. Nzambe abongi nankem. God is worthy to be praised. Soki toza oyo toza lelo ezangolu na ye. If we are who we are today is by his mercy. Mubateli malamu abateli bisu. The great protector has protected us. Mubateli malamu abombi bisu na senangolu na ye. The great protector has kept us under his glory. Mobundi molongi atelemi kobunda pe alongi. The mighty warrior has stood up to fight our battles and has been victorious. Ibele tolamuka kina bangu. Many we woke up with. Lelo bazana bo moite. Today they are no longer alive. Ibele bazala kina ba programe ya kosal. Many had plans that they had planned to complete. But all the plans that they had planned has now ended up halfway. Many woke up this morning to go to work. But they did not return home. Where they went, bad news had occurred. Many went to hospital simply so that they can have a blood But the news has reached to families that they simply went for a blood test and today they are not alive. In other ways, I can say, this is why I always advise the children of God. Do not ever let the devil lie to you for you to get to a point of saying that it is by my own efforts. But tell God that Father, I am who I am is because of you. Father, I praise you because you are worthy, because you are loving, Because you are, de, you deserve the praise. Because you deserve the worship. There is no other light. And there will never be another light. I am grateful by your Merci blood. Thank you, Father. We believe that you would truly help your family this evening. Call a family member. Call a friend. Elder, a friend of yours, and tell them stay connected to Olive TV. Record football, Feel free to record the football match, but take these words in which will help you. Let's give the announcements. Communique à Liboso et Zali Ete le 24, donc. Vendredi oyo na semaine oyo toza na veye de prier. The first announcement is that on the 24th of this month, meaning this Friday, we do have a night vigil. Le 24 juin. The 24th of June. Yapo so toza na yango. Of this week that we are in. Eza vendredi. It's on a Friday. Boye libota na nzambi. That for the family of God. Esengeli. All those that have the desire to pray, do feel free to come and pray with us. Yes, there is a night vigil. Meaning there will not be any Thursday service. De 21 heures à 5 heures Because du matin. we need to rest in order to stand up in front of the throne of God on Friday from 9 p.m. to 5 a.m. Address yango ezako defile na television. The address is the one that's going through on your screen. Zwa yango koki kobeta na toma toma eko sunga yoko mesika tozali. Do you take and put it within a tom tom and you'll reach where we are? Oye kilte a jedi eko zala te. Therefore there is no Thursday service. Sinoko futa transport pa. Or else you'll pay your transport for nothing. Le 15 juye tozana Birmingham. On the 15th of July we are in Birmingham. Veye 
The recent night vigil was amazing. It was lovely. May God bless all those that were with us. May God bless all those that paid for the hall. May the Lord do good to those that have still agreed to pay for the hall again. May the Lord do great things for you. May the Lord bless all those that have accompanied us on that day. It was wonderful. It was wonderful. Therefore, on the 15th of July, adresse, si same address where we usually are, na Highgate, in Highgate, e si na where we had the last night, it's, na Baptiste church. it's in Baptist Church. Post office there is a post office right next to it. Do you feel free to come and pray And the Lord will do great things for you. And we have club friends of Jesus. It is a gathering in which we pray for 5 a.m. to 6 a.m., 9 p.m. to 10 p.m. If you want to pray with us, do take my number and call us after the show and we will connect you. Yes. You will stand up in the Christ. We are preparing ourselves for the return of Christ. Many called for the baptism. Do you have peace because we will announce the date for the baptism? We are waiting for it summer to be to, um, for us to go deeper into summer because then the water will be much warmer than before. Oyo is a lucky community. These were the announcements. Let's read the Bible. Um, the technicians, you've written the wrong verse. It's actually verse 14. John chapter 5, verse 14. John chapter 5, verse 14. Change biso verse one a silvo plan. Please could you change that? Na ye bite so close all under this. I don't know if you're following. Ne koza na teknik. John chapter cinq verse quatorze. Merci. John chapter five. Kolo abeni rion de ko de ko na biso kelo. God bless. To tangi na kombo na yes. You read the name of God. Simana makambo oyo. Yesu akuti ekati na tempelo. Pe alobi na ye ete, tala, osili kobika, sala lisumu te, sala lisumu lisusu te, ete likambo lileki mabe likwe la yote. Afterward, Jesus found him in the temple and said to him, See you have been made well, sin no more, lest the worst thing come upon you. Let's pray for today's word. De gloire, Father of glory. Dieu Abraham, God of Abraham. Dieu Israel, God of Israel. Father, we have come under your throne. That you may speak to your people this May we simply be a root of blessings for your people. May you speak and convince the hearts of your people. For you sent us so that you could save your people as you are returning to take authority. I take authority upon any Anything that does not confess your name, which is in front of us, I capture its powers, and I throw it into dry places. In the name of Jesus Christ, God of Nazareth, the living God. Amen. Amen. Batata. Mothers, fathers, and youths have had the chance to be in front of us today. We were here all together last week, Monday. And the Holy Spirit helped us to speak of the theme of the bad land. 
The Lord addressed himself to his whole church. The Lord addressed himself to all those that had the chance to watch us. And in other ways we can say, the Holy Spirit blessed people the way that it chose to do so on that day. Today the Lord has sent us Upon the words that he spoke to a man, as soon as he entered the temple, he saw a man that was healed. These words are very simple. If you read it, do not sin anymore. Lest something worse happens to you. Ne péche plus. Do not sin anymore. De peur qu'il ne t'arrive quelque chose de pire. Lest something worse comes upon you. Parole moko simple. Simple words. So que au tangi yango. If you read, it's as simple. It's simple. Mais so que au tire attention na parole wana. But if you pay close attention to these words. O koso sora ete parole oyo. You will understand that these words has the duty to save one's life. If you pay attention to these words, you will understand that these words has the duty to warn a person's life. Let me say it in a different way. If you pay attention, to those words. You will see that those words has the duty to protect one's soul. If you pay attention to those words, you will understand these words have the duty to reveal to a person the dangers that lies ahead of them. Let me say in a different way. When you believe in God as your Lord and Savior, you, you must know that the dangers of sin has not just died out. In other ways, I can say, when you believe in God, know that you simply escape from the dangers of the road doing it. Let me say it in a different way. The reality is one. Is that these words are simple revelations. The Lord has revealed the things that are hidden in which human eyes are not able to see. Jesus has revealed the things that the mind of a man could not think of. Jesus awakened one man's conscience that you must never ignore the fact that there is danger ahead. Even if you already healed, although you have already converted your heart, I did not come onto this earth to change the name of a sin. But I came to earth. I changed the name of death and called it sleep. But a sin is still a sin. This revelation is for all those that enter within the church. Let me say it in a different way. This revelation is it has the duty to awaken the conscience of all those that believe in God as their Lord and Savior. But the one, those people, they have received the grace of God. Because the grace of God is the work of God. It's the energy of God. It's the 
It's a favor in which the Lord has done to you. But the Lord has sent me to speak that today's word it has a duty for you to awaken your conscience. Why must you awaken your conscience? Because you have received the grace to be healed freely. So do not play around with it. Don't play around with it. You must protect it because it is dangerous for your soul. All those that have been healed, they must protect the grace of God. The glory that has allowed you to convert your heart. It's not your own effort. It's not my effort. It's the efforts of God. Therefore, you and I. We have the duty to pray to the Father for him to give you strength in order for you to be able to protect that grace. After you receive in grace of healing due to the blood of Christ, you must know you are not allowed to go back to sin. People of God, when you have converted your heart, when you believe in God as your Lord and Savior, you have the duty to continue walking in fear. In other ways, I can say, you are no longer allowed to go back to no, sin. No. Not at all. You're you are not allowed to go back to sin. Because once a person has converted their heart, and once a person believes in God as their Lord and Savior, you must know that you have escaped from some danger. You have escaped from danger. But that specific danger, it still remains. It's still there. You, because you believe in God as your Lord and Savior, the Lord has allowed you to move away from it. And that danger is called death. And that death, it has a duty to take you to hell. When you and I have converted yeah, our heart, know that that death is still there. Yeah, you must know. It has not been moved. It has not died. They have not frowned. It's there. But God has simply saved us from it. Do not go back to sin. Do not go back to sin. You've been healed. Do not go back to sin. Lest a much bigger thing occurs to you. You are saved from danger. That danger in all domains within your life, whether it's within the spiritual domain, when you believe in God, your soul has been protected. It's been protected by God. Even within the physical domain, your blessing it has been saved from the destruction of Satan. Because you believe in God. But Satan is not there. That Satan still is. If you go back to Satan, that Satan will destroy your life. That's the truth. I love God. Ever since he came down onto this earth, he's never pleased it. Jesus spoke of the truth till the day he left this earth. Within the spiritual domain, when you believe in God as your Lord and Savior, know that you have been saved from the danger called hell. When you convert your heart, when you are born again, 
When you become a new creation, once your name has been written in the book of you, you must escape. You have escaped from the dangers of hell. But hell is not moving. Hell still remains. If you go back to sin, you will enter through the door called hell. After you've been saved from sins. After you've been saved from sickness. After the Lord blessing you. You must know. That danger is still somewhere there. That danger is still there. It is not me. The believers of Christ. We have the, we've had the grace grace. But be careful with the grace of God. Be careful with the glue grace that you have received. Be careful with Because the person that is saying. They are grace. Grace, grace is Jesus. He is the work. He is the energy of God. He is the favors of God. To this world. But grace is, is telling something. He said, You've been saved. Do not go back to the Because if you do, worse things will come upon you. If you go back to sin, know that that wrong will come back to you. My Bible says what? Jesus was not screaming these things out on the street. My Bible says Jesus went into the temple. Let's further on our thoughts a bit. If you read that verse, or within the sea of Bethsaida, you say they've never actually written about no. sin. Never. They've never written about sin. But when Jesus had entered into the temple, brothers, do not go back to sin. When Jesus entered into the temple, Jesus revealed what was hidden. Things that nobody knew upon that man. What does the Lord want to say? That person, they were saved twice. They were healed twice. Through the physical journey and through the spiritual journey. Spiritual journey. They were forgiven from their sins. In other ways, this means Jesus wants to say this to I, I forgave your sins. The sins that you did, I have purified But from today, after you've been purified, after you've been forgiven, do not go back to these things. But if you read that verse, they've never written about it. Jesus had to go reveal it. When he entered into the temple, he saw that fog. He was crippled. Who had sat there for a very long time. He had sat there. When they met with Jesus, he said, child, you've been saved. You've been saved. Do not go back to sin. And when he was saying, do not again, do not go back to sin. In other ways, it's mean, that person, they were walking with him. That person, they were a sinner. But when they met with Christ, they were born for the second time. When he met with Christ, he was forgiven from all his sins. When he met with Christ, brother, the glory of God had blown him. He did not make an effort. No, no. Never. Jesus, Jesus, he said to he said, you want to be saved? He said, stand up. And when he was saying, stand, pick up your mat and walk with the sins was forgiven and his health was being restored. 
You've already been saved. Do not sin anymore. Mothers and fathers. You who have had the chance to watch us. Jesus is returning. Therefore, you who have had the chance to convert. Let no one lie to you that you should go back to sin. Listen carefully. Let no one lie to you. You have the duty to walk in fear. Because this man, Jesus was the one that was revealed. That once you've been saved, once you've been forgiven from your sin, once you've been purified by the blood of Christ, you must learn to walk in fear. Do not go back to sin, or else death will come back. Or the door of hell shall see. When the trumpets will call, you will not enter. You will not enter. You won't enter. You won't enter. Do not sin no more. Lest something worse comes upon you. If we further on our thoughts, you will understand that this man, God is good. God is good. People of God, be careful with the grace of God. Today, everyone's now, we have the time of grace. But listen to the word of grace. Grace himself is God. It's him, the faith that the Lord has given to He is grace. He is He did not say that once you have converted your heart, that you should continue let me tell you, yes, Jesus did not change the name of his sin. Never. He simply took our sin. But sin, if you believe in God, you will escape from danger. But the sin is still there. It's still there. It's still there. Do not sin no more. Lest something worsens comes upon you. In other ways, we can say. Once a person believes in God as their Lord and Savior, when you have been saved from sin, when you have been saved physically, after you've been forgiven, from sin, you need to be careful with sins because danger can come back. To you. A lot of believers today, they have a lot of problems in their life. Maybe because of the evangelism of life. But you must read the Bible, children. Grace did not authorize us to continue no, sinning. No. Never. Grace, Grace is us from Grace and that's all over. Grace is the one that was speaking. When he entered into the temple, one. he looked at his body. He said, you're safe. The way you're safe, do not go back to sleep. Because that danger is still around. You see that sickness? You see that death? I have removed it from you. And because you now believe in me, because you are now mine, because because that father, he reached the temple to pray to who? That, that father. The one that was saved from the temple. He came to the temple to pray to Jesus. The honor of the church had entered into him. And when he met with him, Jesus said to him, You've done good that you have come back to him. If you believe him, that's your here. Forget the word. Do not go back to the church. I am the owner of the church. I am the owner of the church. I am the owner of the church. Where you have entered, you're not allowed to go back to sin. Oh, people of God. We must convert the hearts. You who keep going back to sin. 
The Lord is addressing himself to you. The Lord is speaking to you. The Lord is addressing himself to his church worldwide. And that church is you and I. Jesus is addressing himself to you. You who believe in God as your Lord and Savior. The Lord wants. That after you converting your heart, after you converting your heart, the Lord is addressing himself to you so that you should not go back to sin. After you being saved, the owner of the church is speaking. Grace is the one speaking. That he is returned. Jesus is returned. Do not go back to sin. Lest something worsen happen to you. Within the church, we have a multiple categories. The Lord is addressing himself to the pastor. The Lord is addressing himself to the doctors. He is addressing himself to the evangelist. He is addressing himself to the prophet. He is addressing himself to the poet. That do not go back. To sin. Do not go back to sin. Let something worse occur to you. In other ways, this can mean after you convert, you have the duty to walk in fear in God. If you say no, we're in the time of grace. Even if the sin comes, it will not do it. I'm telling you that Satan has entered into Satan this. Satan has come to this world. He has also taken the Bible in his words. And he has the duty to simplify the word so that people can fall into sin. People of God, yes, the Lord is returned. Mokolo, yes, the day that the, the Lord Mokolo, will return, trompete, kobete, the day that the trumpets will nazo, call, I'm telling you that no pastor will be judged in your Mama, name. Yo your mother will not speak upon The Lord will not come and just gather everyone up as a no, group. No, no, no. no. Even if we are in the same church, if you do not convert your your neighbor will go and you will remain. Going to church is not a synonym of conversion. In the kingdom of God, the Lord wants people that have been born for the second time. If you have already been born in the kingdom, if you have already been born in the, in the maternity, that's when you have the grace to be able to see the Lord on the earth. And when you are born for the second time, do not go back to sin. We are Hello. Hello, bonsoir, Papa. Bonsoir, Mama. Let's pray for you. Seigneur de gloire. Father of glory. Dieu d'Abraham. God of Abraham. Dieu d'Israël. God of Israel. Salé la moine à yo bola mounsa. May you do goodness to your child, Lord. Sunga bo moina ye. Help her life. Pambola bango. Bless them. Pesa bango mote ma ya kobanga yo. Give them a heart to fear you. Mokolo ya suka toko tana bango na nkemo. So that on the last day we may enter within your world. Na kombo ya Yesu Christo ya nazare. In the name of Jesus Christ. Nzambe na bo moine. The living God. Amen. 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 The Lord is addressing himself to his family. The Bible states that the salary of sin is death. You have the duty to fear God. When you believe, God, do not go back. If you go back to sin, let something worse come upon 
Today you may not know his thing. But the day that those trumpets. That's when you will understand the things that the Lord was saying, which was wrong, 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 or the dangers that will occur will occur to you. Jesus has sent his word so that you can come. Hello. Hello? Where are you calling us from? What's your name? Hello? 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 Oui, Mama. Kota la television ayote. Do you not watch your TV? Hello? We can hear Hello, you. Hello, Papa. I was singing your song. Oh, God, the Lord is my Papa. We sing with the music of Panama. We make the music of Panama. We sing 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 the music of Panama. Let's pray for you. Nzambe na nkem. Father of glory. Nzambe na bomon. The living God. May you awaken your child's conscience. May you shut the doors of thought in which the devil is aggressing her As from today. Give her peace. Remove bad thoughts In your name, Jesus Christ, God of Nazareth, the living God. Amen. Amen. The Lord has sent me this evening to tell all those that believe that do not go back to sin. Do not return to sins no more. Let no one lie to you. Let them not say to you we are in the times of grace. Grace is addressing himself to the church. He said after you've been saved, after you've been forgiven, after you've been opened, after you've been purified by his blood, do not go back to sin. Because if you go back to sin, less something worse will come about. And what is that thing? You will find yourself in hell. People know that you go to church. People know that you go to pray. People know that you preach. People know that you are preaching. If you are walking in sin, you will find yourself in hell. May you convert your hearts this evening. Hello. Hello. Hello, Papa. Bonsoir, Mama. Bonsoir, Papa Nangai. Obengi biso ab komolona. Papa komolona se rani na bingi na province na 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 kwa ya lishuna lishumu kwa kwa na ndima kini jambe mbiki sana na nyoso na zina na mbimba yye za yye so kye te me za pa na zana lobi na kutala vahe mbimbo 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 kwa kutala nuko na ngabana ya kutu na temi kwa za tukuta na kate kwa za kina problem na mwa sina ye na sengi na tambo na kimi na mwona baona kimi na tuna kimi na kire anzande kimi na ngapona edi sana bangote Let's pray for you. Father of glory, have mercy upon your daughter. Forgive her as she has recognized her wrongs in front of you. You sent your word not to judge, but rather to save you. Have mercy upon her, Father. I leave her travel within your hands. You go with her on the journey. Let your love be filled with in, this in the name of Jesus Christ, God of Nazareth, Nazareth, the living God. Amen. 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 Those people calling on my mobile, call on the landline. Because I'm not able to answer you mobile, on mobile, please call us on the landline. I've been sent by the Lord this evening. 
To tell people worldwide that Jesus is returning. You who have not yet converted your heart, I plead in the name of God. The King of Glory is returning to take his church. Who is he coming to take? It's those that believe in him as their Lord and Savior. Those that refuse to go back to no one. They are the Bible. ones that Father is coming to take. Yes, Jesus is returning. You go to church. This word is The Lord said, do not go back Hello. to it. Hello. Hello. Bonsoir, Papa. Bonsoir, Mama. Bonsoir, Please put the volume up. Please put the Our mother's an island. The Lord has revealed himself to your husband. May the glory go back to the Father. May God bless you. Today the Lord has given peace to our mother's home because of the channel that we pray. May the glory go back to you, God. Thank you because you have revealed yourself to you. That they may receive the words that you have given in the name Nazareth. of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Merci. Thank you. You who went back to sin, move away from sin. I plead you in the name of God. Confess. Confess. Confess your sin. If you stand up to pray and confess, nothing bad will occur to you. Because the Lord is in need of you. Hello. Hello. Bonsoir, Mama. Eh, hey, bonsoir. Eh, na lingi papa na lo bapu na yo osambe la pu na ngana ba na ngai. Hmm. Na zako vanda na na vani na mitsa mukomo na ngama melen. Hmm. Siko yo na zako mo na ke onjere ba tentation ezo la na ngami. Chaque fois na la na kapuye ya pokwa me omo na zala ba ninga ba ninga ba zulinga kaku. Hello. Hello. Mama Katan. Tikato Mama. Sungayo. But let's help Hello. Mama Nabiso Katan. Our mother is 
been cut off. One, one thing I will help him of if you're following. Learn how to say no to your friends. Please God. Do not please your friends. If they hate you because of God. God himself will protect. Attach yourself to prayer. Attach yourself to the word. Because Jesus is return. If you attach yourself to friends, when the trumpets will be with you and your friends, you will find yourself in hell. Let's pray for you. Father of glory, God of Abraham, God of Israel, Father, I leave your child in your hands. Have mercy upon her. Give her heart to say no. And to stand upon any satanic spirit that stood against her friends, that she should please you and your children. And may she enter within your glory. In your name, Jesus Christ, God of Nazareth, the living God. Amen. Amen. The something which is much worse is called hell. Because that pain will be ever lost. Hell has not been created for you. You who are still in sin. The Lord is addressing himself to you. We did not have much time. There is a short period of time left. The angels have the trumpets at hand. The Lord simply wants you to convert. He wants you to repent and come back to him. He wants you to stop going down the wrong path. Because he is returning to take his church. You who fell into sin. Confess. 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 And the Lord with his mercy he will forgive. Grace is the one speaking. So be careful with grace. Be careful with grace. Grace, do not neglect Because it. Because we have been saved not by our own efforts. But there is one job that Jesus had done for you and I to be saved. If you go back to sin, it means you see the work of the cross as if it's nothing. You who believe it, do not commit an error to go back. Because if you do, less something worse will occur to you. And what's that worse? It's hell. It's hell. It's hell. hell. Jesus is returning. Jesus is crying to you. Those that believe in God as their Lord and Savior, the church of Christ, the servant of God, is started with God. Good. And now you have gone off the path and entered with the Jesus. The Lord has sent me not to judge you. The Lord has sent to tell you, move away from me. He's returned. Yes, Jesus is returned. People of God, those that have ears, may you listen. You will say you did not hear. I'm a loud voice within the desert. I'm not looking for money. I'm not looking for glory. But I am telling you the words coming from Jesus. That the trumpets are about to blow. If you went back to sin, may you confess your sins. For there is something worse which will occur. The Lord is a father. When he sent me, because he loved me, he sent me, not so that I can wear pride, not so that I can look for money. The one that's been sent by God, he does not look for me. The one that is sent by God, they look for the soul of And money will come without me even having to ask. The family of God, 
you have been saved, do not go back. You've now been saved, do not go back to sin. You've been saved. What has called you to go back? Yambola. Confess. Yambola. Confess. Yambola. Confess. If you confess, you will have the grace and will enter heaven. Yes, the Lord is returning. Yes, the Lord is returning. Yes, the Lord is returning. You who are still walking in sin, the Lord is returned. You fell into sin. The Lord is your father. The Lord has a way of saving you. If you will decide to stop wrong for, for believing and remember the pain of Christ. Remember the sufferings of Jesus. And you confess your sin. The Lord will have mercy. The Lord will forgive you. The Lord will open you. The Lord will remove all the bad things. The Lord will allow your blessings to actually be. The Lord will pick you up from the ground. No matter how many people that may fight against you, they will not see you. You have been saved. The church of God. The believers of God. You've been saved by the blood of God. You have the grace of God. Do not go back to sin. Do not go back to sin. The Lord is returned. The Lord is returned. The Lord is returned. The, Lord is returned. the trumpets are about to fall. Mothers and fathers, the Lord has sent me to tell you the truth. I'm not looking for glory. I'm not looking for money. The one that I have has already been saved. Because having God himself is wealth much more than money. The God that has sent me, he has sent me for your healing. The family of God. I'm at the end of today's show. You had the chance to follow a God, right? Maybe you want to convert your heart today. Maybe you fell into sin. Maybe you're sick. I want to help you with a prayer. Let's pray. Father of glory. God of Abraham. God of Israel. Forgive your children. Purify them with your blood. Protect them under your glory. May your mercy. I declare healing to all those that are sick. All those that have problems with your body. Let this evening may they receive their In the name of Jesus Christ, God of the living God. Amen. Amen. We're at the end of today's show. Let the living God bless club friends of Jesus. Let the living God bless the resurrection ministry. Let the living God bless all the partners which are helping. They're helping the space. Let the living God bless your vanishes for Let the living God bless all those that pick up the phone. Let the living God bless our brother Gelo who was in technician. Friday we have a night vision. If the living God does not return we will see you on Friday in the night vigil. Or others will meet again on Monday. But if the Lord returns to take us, you and I will meet in the heavens. Let the living God bless the family of God. Thank you, bye.